BSI. Uh, at this point in time, I would instruct my assistant to hold and maintain the head in a neutral inline position and uh, keep maintaining the head until uh, I instruct her to release. Um, let's see. Uh, I would uh, check pulse motor sensory. Uh, Ma'am, can you feel on me here? Yes. Can you feel on me here? Yes. Okay. Pulse is present. Pulse is present. Go ahead and squeeze my fingers. Can you feel what I'm doing here? Yes. Can you feel what I'm doing here? Yes. Go ahead and move your chest on. Okay. Pulse is present. Pulse is present. Alrighty. Uh, I would then uh, measure the patient's neck, select an appropriately sized uh, seat collar. Secure the patient to the spine board. Starting with the shoulder strap, we're going to put them around the shoulders slightly behind so that the patient won't be able to slip around once we start moving the uh, spine board. the chest. At this point in time, I'm going to take over uh, C-spine, and uh, my assistant will grab that box.
this point in time, I'm going to reassess pulse, mo pulse motor sensory. Can you feel what I'm doing here now? Yeah. And yeah. Pulse is present. Pulse is present. Go ahead and squeeze my finger. Can you feel what I'm doing here? Yeah. And here? Yeah. Uh, pardon. Pulse is present. Pulse is present. Go ahead and move your chest for me. At this point in time, the patient is uh, able to ask her to interlock her fingers, um, and I would uh, duct tape the feet, uh, and then we would uh, transport. Uh, I am now finished with this exam. Is there anything that you would like to add, change, or do differently? Uh, no. Uh, BSI, if I have said it. Thank you very much.